You know, there's a, a lot that we have to understand about the resistance welding. One is that we need a constant temperature of our electrodes. That consistency of that temperature of those electrodes depends on that water cooling. When you first have that tub of ice water, that barrel of ice water, it's going to be very cold. And that little recirculator pump isn't going to give us a constant flow. We need a constant flow through those electrodes, through that tooling, to keep those components at a consistent temperature. And so we use a chiller because it has a closed loop water system. It has a pump in it. And so it will keep that water flow consistent with the same temperature, keeping our components at the same temperature.